Alright, Bab and Beeb. So this is actually how I have my store set up, which is a little bit different. So I'm going to show you while I'm offline and have OBS up. So for me, I do mine so that people do have to purchase it. I do have some free ones. So we do bank points. And you can see right here, here's my store link. Um, yeah, I have enough money. So for this, here's my store. You guys got to see it earlier. And so I actually have two different setups here. So I have items like my cabbages and like Gandalf. And I don't think it shows anywhere on the store, but these aren't actually sound effects alone. These are full items. Meanwhile, I have items like GG, Noobs, and Toad as individual uh, sound effects. So what actually happens is that this should let me do it. I can redeem items here by clicking redeem. So like redeem item. I can redeem. And as you can see, what happens is it shows up, and with this one, you actually get the full GIF, which is sometimes what you want. For other things like GG Easy or Toad or anything, maybe you just want the sound effect. So you do that, and with these, you redeem. Oh, actually, I have that one. So let's go down here to one that I know is just a sound effect. So I have, uh, for example, I have Hello, which is just a sound effect. You can see the little turtle dude says hello. And so it doesn't actually show up with any redemption item. Well, you can also, I have all of these sets that they're redeemable in chat. And I have, either you can do like bang, redeem, Navi, which might be on a cooldown. It looks like it is, or I misspelled redeem. Nope, there it goes. So it just took a little while. So right, it just, nothing showed up on screen. It was just a redeem. But then again, we can do like redeem Gandalf, which is a little bit longer and it's an item. Let's see here. So with that, right, it shows who redeemed it and it does give you that little gif. It's not necessarily as long as I want right now, but those are two different options. And so for those to be set up that way, I'm going to show you how I did that. And I'm going to show you the other things. So for those, I showed you how to use the redeem command. So I also have it set up where you can do just bang, drop it, and that will redeem a sound effect, which is kind of, I think, more what you guys are looking for. So like bang, drop it, which is one of my free sound effects. So like, it goes over everything, of course it does kinda, of course I do have my music playing just like it as if I was doing a normal stream, and it does kinda conflict with it, so it is something to keep in mind, but this is a lot easier of people to learn, so I'm gonna show you guys how to do that too. So down in my stream store, you have my items, like I showed you guys, like Gandalf for example. So for edit item, I have this one set up as a stream perk. That way it shows who redeemed it, it shows a custom gift, and it plays a sound. So I set stream perk, name, which is also going to be the command that I use, but it's also going to be, if they don't know how to do it, redeem Gandalf. I have all of these set on about an average cooldown of 5 minutes global and then 10 minutes for users. Negative 1 means that can be used infinite amount of times which is what you're going to want to set it to. And for item content I have a preview image as well as the sound and you upload everything to here and just like when you upload images or videos it all gets uploaded here. And then you can actually go to up to upload, submit and then it will be inserted. And then I have it redeem this item shows an alert. This is what actually shows the GIF and is only available as a stream perk. I have it redeemable via chat. And then Gandalf is a subscriber only. I have other items like I showed you, such as Navi or Smash, which are only sound effects. And so these have the advantage of it doesn't take up the alert. They're a little, for me, I make them a bit cheaper. And they don't have that necessary moment. And it doesn't take up any bit of the screen. So with these, it's the same thing. It's named as Smash. Item content, I do have a preview image just to make my store look better. But you can see that the checkbox that says shows an alert is gone because it's just a sound effect. And then I have item command Smash. So like it shows bang redeem, Smash. So, with those, right, that's how you set up a sound effect, that's how you set up a stream, 
And then uh, what you need to make sure is for your overlay, right now I have my general alert overlay here. And I have hidden when active, hidden when active. So it's the store redemptions right here. Oh, it might double up. Because I think it's going to play here too. So I'm actually going to shut the music off. Because it's playing in the browser now. Um, right here is the important one. And for this, I didn't change anything. I just added it. I do have the basic sound in this. Which doesn't show up unless people... And they're not used unless something's defaulted. So for example, if we go over here, I have a dab command where people can pay me to dab using their narwhal bucks. So I have it set, so let's bang dab. And this, I do have an, uh, I do have an image set for it, but I don't have a sound effect set for it. So bang dab, I don't have enough money. Uh, let me see how to give more narwhal bucks. Um... This is my bad. I'm going to try and cut this. So actually, this is annoying. But um, what's going to happen is it would show up on here. And it would show dab with the item. And then it actually would play this sound effect since I don't have one set. But as long as you have this here, you should be good to go. You do this like any other one where you copy this as a browser source in Chobe. Yes, I'm sure you guys know that. Now one of the cool things I did earlier, and I'm going to show you now, is you go down to your chat commands. And you can see here, I have a bang SFX, which allows the following SSFSX commands are available. That way they don't have to go to the store if they don't want to. And then, for example, Cabbages or Gandalf from earlier, right? Bang Gandalf. What that does is it's a dollar, dollar sign for the variable and then redeem Gandalf. So you just do this with each one. It is a little tedious, but it does make it a lot easier on your users on remembering commands and everything. If you set everything to free, then these just become regular sound effects, and it's really easy. Hopefully this helps you guys. If you're still having issues, let me know. Bye.